Okay, so we'll be talking about how my parents met and my birth and maybe my childhood. So my parents met in Mexico and my mother was living in my aunt's house and my father was renting a room with her, or with I mean with my aunt. So my father said when he saw my mother, it was like love at first sight, but my, mo my mother never paid attention to him. She was like, eh, whatever. And then um, some way they fell in love. And then um, over there in Mexico, it's like a very traditional thing where the guy has to go to the girl's house to ask for her or like to like ask the parents that he's going to marry her, something like that. So my dad did that when he went to my mother's house. But my mother was like, oh, you should not go because my father has a shotgun and he's going to come out and shoot you. And my father was all scared. But either way, he ended up going. And then that's when they had, well, no, that's when they got married. And then they had my older sister. And then they had me. But my birth story is kind of crazy because at the time, my father didn't have a car. And... My father didn't have a car, and when they were living in the house, well, my mom was pregnant already of me, and the neighbors downstairs told told them, oh, if you, if you guys need a ride to the hospital, when your wife is gonna give birth, you could tell me. But to their bad luck, my father went, and the car wasn't working. So my mother was already having contractions and pains, and my father was like, oh, just go take a warm shower, it will work for you. No, that was bad, it was worse. So now she was feeling like I was about to come out, and then um, they were looking for rides and or taxis, and I think they found a ride, and then they were like, my father was like, just keep going, just keep going fast because she's gonna have the baby. And then the guy was going like past the red lights and stuff. And then they got to the hospital and then they gave her like a wheelchair, but mom was like, no, I don't need a wheelchair. I just wanna go inside and lay down and just get the baby out. And as soon uh -huh. as she got into the hot or to the room, um, she laid down and she said that I came out like so quick and that my mom and dad were like, you just wanted to see the world already. <laughs> and I was like, oh, okay. And then, um, <laughs> and then, oh yeah, so I'll talk about my childhood. So um, in my childhood, I used to, when I was smaller, I used to play um, soccer with my brother. Uh, my brother is one of those kids that he loves, loves soccer a lot. So I was playing and I was being the goalie and I was like jumping, but I was, but then I jumped and then I stepped on my ankle and I twisted it. And he was like, oh, are you okay? And I was like, no, I was like crying. And he's like, okay, I'll let you win. And I was like, wow, that doesn't change nothing. <laughs> and I remember I just went inside and it just put me on warm warm water with salt and so basically that's the my birth story and why my family is important thank you